Welcome to Santa Barbara. I'm here with father-daughter duo, Captain David, Captain Tiffany. This is the Ugly Tour Saltwater Session. Give me an idea of exactly where we're at. 34 degrees, 24.335 north. Okay, that's helpful. <laughs> Santa Barbara Harbor, where we've got uh, a lot of pleasure craft, but we also have a very serious working harbor. There's a lot of commercial fishing activity in the harbor, and it's carefully maintained that way. You can go watch the commercial guys work and see them unload their catch and whatnot. It's a, it's a much more interesting thing for people and that's important to Santa Barbara. So your daughter Tiffany and you have been fishing together for a long time. This is a family affair. Tiffany has fished with me all of her life and she's now a captain, manages our family tackle store and uh, wraps rods, repairs reels. She kind of does it all and I'm blessed to have her with me. I'd be in a heap of trouble without her. Yeah, she's pretty amazing. What we're gonna start out fishing for, ground fish, rock fish, like, like vermilion rock fish, copper rock fish, and ling cod. Those are kind of prehistoric looking, right? Ling cod, that's the only fish I'll nickname after a dinosaur. A good keeper ling cod, we call a lingosaur. What are you seeing there? Bait. We're gonna catch some mackerel. We're gonna use sabikis and we're gonna jig up some mackerel for bait. And then we're gonna go parlay them into something bigger. How many feet? 20. So what you do is you're gonna hold it, the line, pull this down and just pull it out 20 times. Okay. How many hooks are we working with them? Four? Six. So as soon as you feel it, yep. reel it in because if you keep letting it out, you're gonna lose them. There you go. You've gotta be kidding me. And these are jack mackerel. And there's our bait. You all really know what you're doing. We put these down there for a second and they hit. Let's be done with bait. Rig the torch, yeah, for, for deep running. Hey, we're gonna, we're gonna open it up now. When you get bit by a ling cod, yeah. don't react. Okay. Hold your right hand up and we'll walk you through it. <laughs> because they're gonna come up. This is a fish's mouth. They're gonna come up and they're gonna bite right here, but they're nowhere near the hook. Understand. And so you're gonna have to wait till he like bites up. So here, have you ever done rockfish before? I haven't. Okay, let me show you how to drop it down. You're gonna wait till he tells you to drop. Go ahead and drop. Pull the lever down and let it free flow as fast as it can, just barely skimming your line with like a feather. And you can count how many feet. I love this line. So you feel a, a bump, 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 and you kind of wait through that. When you feel a steady pull, you do that medium hook set and start cranking slow to medium speed. Okay, let's see if we can make that happen. There it is. Bring it up. Once you make the commitment on these fish, Remember, they have that air bladder. So when you stop, they can float right off. So you probably had two, but bring it in and let's see what we got. Well, there's definitely some weight on there. Tune in next week when I pull this fish in. There we go. What do we got? Speaking of prehistoric fish, huh? Green, Green stripe. stripe. Green stripe rockfish. Can you get the mackerel? Drop them back down. 350 feet. After all this time, you still have a passion for it. Oh, more than a passion. Yes, I do. I got one too, Captain. That's a double. The cormorant. The cormorant took the fish. <laughs> oh, right there in front of you? Oh, no, there he no, is. No, get out of here. Is there any way for me to avoid this? Yeah, I got the cormorant busy over here. There you go. 
No. Look at that, that's a wing, huh? That's a little wing. This is what we were talking about. Well, a little bit bigger. They got teeth and they ain't afraid to use them. And how big are they gonna get? Oh, this guy, there's lingcod down here the size of your leg. Let's go get some. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. Nice. A vermilion. Nice. Look at that. What a beautiful fish. Now this is a vermilion rockfish. Very tasty critter. It's biting again. There it is. Start cranking. Crank, 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 crank. Well, that's a long way up. Those 300 feet. Oh, two of them. She's getting the net. Keep its head in the water. We put down a squid. We put down a mackerel. We pull in two big wings. That's incredible. So these are huge, massive, yeah. prehistoric teeth. I see right here too. Okay, you've rested enough. Go get more. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> Let's do it. Yeah, I mean, I can feel him biting right there. There, there it is. But it's not two this time. It's one. <laughs> you That's sure? okay. How many do I have to get to get a cool hat like your father? It's gonna take you some decades. Another link. Just a very controlled ascent. Keeps that animal as docile as possible. Reduces the risk of it pulling the hook. And see that head toss, it's up at ambient light and it doesn't like it. Lingcod color. Sure enough. And this one is on the Ling Slayer. That's a lure I designed years ago on my charter boat specifically for catching lingcod. Nice, Cap. He's trying to go back down. <laughs> so you don't ever get tired of this, I mean. All the times you do it, you still love it. Yep. Your best bet is to just slowly grind it up. That's when you just rely upon the captain to teach you how it's done. Nice network, by the way. <laughs> Thanks, Cap. I learned it from watching you. That is a serious fish. Look at the size of the head on that beast. Wow. This is a lingosaur. I love it. The bonnet head is huge. Nice thing about Santa Barbara is you've got mountains, you've got beautiful town, you've got beach, you've got the water, you've got the Channel Islands. I mean, it's just this total picturesque package. And once offshore, I never get tired of these views. Yeah, this is breathtaking. Beautiful surroundings, great people. This is the life. I fell in love with Santa Barbara. Fishing with the best. Thanks, Captain Tiffany. Thanks, Captain David. That's a wrap on Saltwater Sessions. See you soon. Hit it, Cap. Hi. So you were saying over here that there's... Yeah, over there. Actually, you see the, the orange building over there, the big yeah. tall one? That's actually...